Hey guys, what's up? It's Mirage here with another unboxing video. It's a PS4 game. Well, actually it's available both on the PS4, PS3, and the Vita. It is called Odin Sphere Life Thrasher. Leaf Thrasher. Odin Sphere. Leaf Thrashy Sire. Crap. Whatever. Odin Sphere. Huh comes in this bag, so I got the one that was on the PS4, because I think there was only collectors on the PS4. Uh, it cost me a hundred bucks? Not really too sure, I just kind of throw my money out there. Don't double check or anything. hundred dollars in Canada, I don't know what the cost is in pounds or arrows or in, um, or American or whatnot. It's a sleeve, because you open it. comes with another nifty little, little box, which has the map of... I don't know. This box, you know, it looks like one of those holiday, Christmas holiday boxes where pretty much when you buy clothes for someone, you buy a gap or something, they, they wrap it in a box like this and then you could, to make it easier for you to wrap it. So it's reusable, you put secrets in your shit, Athrax, I don't know, whatever, do, do it, it's your own box now. Box confinements is, and I really, really can get enough on how amazing and smart they were at this. Usually when you get collectors, you either get the you get the tin case, which is empty, but it has the inserts to put the disc, or just the, with the regular case, which has a disc, and you open it, and if you want, you can swap it between cases. That would bother me, because if I were if I were to know that one case was on my shelf and I know there's no disc inside, I'm like, fuck, that drives me insane. Probably doesn't do for a lot of people, but for me, it drives me insane. So they give you the physical, I mean, the regular case game inside. The tin case, which is very beautiful art of Gwendolyn, and then the front cover pretty much of the case with all the characters. And this is a cool little sh you actually put it inside, and then, you know, it's like a protective case, and then you could put it together against your wall. Thank you. <gasps> so much. Just me, this actually made me so happy, I don't know why, it was like, <sighs> a t-shirt, mostly a plain black tee, pretty much shows you a recipe of how to make, what is it, is it Blaze? No, I'm not doing that because I can't actually see. It's on how to make um, the Blaze Potion, which, you know, engulfs your enemies in flames. <sighs> oh my god, it's almost a chest, but I want to wear a belt to it. Accentuate my my uh what are those things women have? Waists? Yeah, totally. Ugh. I'll just leave it on because it's too much work to take clothes off. So I don't go shopping. I'll print of uh, I'll take the plastic off because I have really bad lighting. Alice, yes. That's her name, Alice. And pretty much when you start the game, you, you kinda of take control over you can just put the cat sit on the goddamn armchair and then read the books, which is once you start reading the books, it's the story of Odin Sphere. And next piece is, of course, the generic art book that comes with every collector's. Except the only difference is that this one's a hardcover, and the pre-order book is paper cover. Not really missing out. I mean, I guess it's fancy. <sighs> oh yeah. So that's actually pretty much it. I'm sorry. Very small collectors. That's why I bought it because it wasn't as expensive. I know I was supposed to buy the Doom, but then when I was like, oh, fuck, it's gonna cost me 200 bucks. I really don't have room for that. I just couldn't at the time. But I do hope you guys enjoy this short video of me talking very fast and getting out of breath because I'm talking too fast. Sorry, it's nerve I'm nervous when I do these things. Anyways, please don't forget to check us out on the hidden levels for pretty grand people. Also don't forget to check me on my normal YouTube, which will be posted below because I can't remember <laughs> anything. <laughs> <sighs> Anyways, I will try to keep posting on a regular basis, if anything, once or twice a week. It's really 
I love doing these things. I get, you know, I'm awkward in front of a camera. I have to realize I have to get used to it. Thus, I need to practice. Thanks again, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that with Clutches of Odin Sphere. That's already out on the for the PS4, PS3, and also the Vita. Grab your hands. The game's actually wonderful. It is just pretty much a read re-adaption and remaster of the one on PS2, but it's wonderful and I'm glad I got a chance to play it. I'm gonna go now because I keep talking, I'm gonna pull the fuck up and I'm talking too fast, so beautiful.